Analyzing human motion in videos is a challenging task and a central research topic in computer animation. While humans move in three dimensions, the vast majority of human motions are captured in two dimensions, strongly dependent on the geometric properties of the person and the camera view angle. In this work, we address the challenging problem of retargeting a video captured motion of one human performer to another. Our approach is to extract an abstract, character and camera agnostic representation of human motion directly from ordinary video and apply it to other, possibly very different skeletons. In addition, our approach enables the reprojection of the reconstructed skeleton to new view angles that are extracted from other videos. With our approach, we avoid the need for 3D reconstruction and 3D retargeting. This is despite impressive recent progress in 3D human pose recovery from video, which is still an error-prone process that we bypass by working directly in 2D. Our key idea is to train a deep neural network to decompose temporal sequences of 2D poses into dynamic and static representations and recombine them back. The network is designed such that a resulting latent motion representation is duration-dependent while the other attributes are encoded into a duration-independent latent space. In practice, we use three encoders that are trained to decompose the videos into three attributes, motion, skeleton, and view angle, which are then shuffled and recomposed to form novel synthesized motions that are compared to ground truth. Our ground truth is generated from synthetic data that contains animations of 3D characters with different skeletal properties which perform the same motion and follow kinematic constraints. During the process, we implicitly learn to cluster motions in the dynamic latent space, where each cluster consists of similar motions performed by different individuals. For more details, please refer to the paper. Our results demonstrate that we can transfer motion between 2D skeletons even when their bones proportions or view angles are different. In addition, the continuous learned latent spaces enable independent interpolation of motion, skeletons, and views between pairs of sequences. Here we compare our method to other retargeting methods using 3D characters. The ground of truth can be seen on top of each output. Here we compare our method using videos in the wild. In order to perform the comparison with those methods, we use the full 3D pipeline, including 3D pose estimation, 3D retargeting, and camera pose estimation. Given a reference actor in a video, our technique enables the retargeting of his motion to a motion of a driving actor and regeneration of his performance using the state-of-the-art video generation techniques. The transfer is enabled although the bone proportions of the actor are very different, a task unachievable by a global scaling. Using our motion latent representation, we implemented a motion search engine that allows search for a query motion inside a dataset of videos in the wild where the search is agnostic to the proportions of the character and camera view angle. The search can be performed on videos with different temporal length and to temporally localize the motion inside the sequence using a single convolution. It can be seen that our method can find videos that exhibit similar motions to those captured in various camera view angles and temporally localize them. Our method fails to reconstruct motions that exhibit large variation in the 2D scale or in the view angle.
Thank you.